Hey guys, guys welcome, welcome back, back to our channel. channel. So today we'll be heading out to Denmark. We won't say why, but we'll catch up with you guys later. So bye. bye. Yo, we're back. So we just landed in Denmark and we're on our way to a fam famous Danish celebrity's mansion. Her name is Riley Benner. And we were invited to brighten up her day because she's going through some really tough stuff. Who could blame her? Her mom just died. Yeah. Some yeah. tough stuff. All right, well. All right. But anyway, just follow us to see the mansion. Welcome, welcome. Don't be shy to shake Hi. my hand. I don't bite. Um, so maybe give us a taste of your quality. Maybe a passionate speech. Speech would you like to hear? Also, do you mind if we film? We're up and coming YouTubers. Yeah, I don't care. It's whatever. And I only heard you guys recite a speech once since everybody thought it sucked. I loved it though. I thought it was clever. It was about Priam's murder. Maybe start from there. <laughs> but the wind. Bro, look at Created that. by the sword is enough to make the weakened old man fall. Shit, Just then, amazing. the city of Ilium, as if She's feeling this fatal blow to its oh ruler, collapses in flames, and the crash captures Priam's attention. Dang. His sword, which was falling onto Priam's white-haired head, seemed to hang in the air. Pyrrhus stood there, wow. like a man in a Dang. painting. Oh my god, this is way too long. Please excuse him, he clearly has no taste. We'll finish this performance later. Melonius, please take them to their room and treat them with respect. Yes, ma'am. You better. Follow him, ladies. We'll finish the play tomorrow. Oh, wow. Hey, do you think we could perform the murder of Gonzago? Of course we can. And if I add a few extra lines in the play, do you think you can have it memorized? Uh, yeah. <gasps> okay, cool. Guys, come so look at cool. this. Oh my god. Look at the big old room. Look at the bed. We're gonna sleep here. What? Oh. Now I'm alone. It's crazy how an actor could force his soul to feel made up feelings. He grew pale and shed real tears, and all for Hecuba, who means nothing. Just imagine what he would do if he had a real reason for feeling the way I do. He would drown the stage with his tears and burst the audience's ears with his crazy, terrible words. Dr drive the guilty speculators crazy, terrify the innocent ones. But what do I do? Mope around, not even bothering with plans for revenge. And I can say nothing, nothing at all on behalf of my mother's whose dear life was stolen. Am I a coward? Is there anyone out there who will call me a villain and slap me hard? I wish someone would do that because I'm a pussy. Otherwise, I would have shown the world what a low life on I have. Inhuman villain. Ugh, revenge. My dear mother's been murdered and I've been urged to seek revenge by heaven and hell. And yet all I can do is stand around cursing like a little I need to get myself together, man. <sighs> I've heard that guilty people watching a play have been so affected by the scenes that they're driven to confess their crimes out loud. I'll have those actors perform something, like my mother's murder in front of my aunt. The play will uncover her guilty conscience by her expression. If that becomes pale, I'll confirm the ghost's accusations and seek my revenge. <sighs> That's what I'll do. Yes, I'll get to it. Where? Hey, do you have a camera? No, where'd you leave it? I don't know. Check the... The table, maybe? Oh, thing, it's right here. Oh, it's recording. Hey, guys, so we're in a Benner boom right now, and this is big. Yeah. But anyways, we forgot the camera on the table yesterday after we gave Riley the speech. We? Girl, I gave that whole speech. <laughs> yeah, okay, whatever you yeah um anyways we didn't know that the camera was still recording mm -hmm. after we went to go well after she went to go get the camera we realized it was still recording but listen to this after we looked back at the footage we found out some juicy ass cheese mix big ass cheese mix. yeah all right you guys so check this out so basically riley's aunt claudia killed riley's own mother 
because she was crushing on her husband, Ooh, her that's sister's some shady husband. Ass yes, really? That's crazy. What the f Basically, this whole performance, like, we're just gonna record it and then we'll just keep you guys updated with what happens. Yep. Because, okay, guys. Yeah, so stay tuned. Keep up with Stay us. tuned if you yeah. wanna find out. <laughs> hey guys, so today's a big day, so we're here rehearsing. You guys are preparing, right? Yes. yes. Okay, so make sure you're doing it as I told you. Don't exaggerate too much. If I wanted someone to exaggerate, I would have hired a news anchor. And don't use too many hand emotions either. Keep your emotions smooth and moderate. Yes, ma'am. But don't be too boring either. If I wanted someone boring, I would have... Ugh, I don't even know. Okay, you need to represent people's true emotions. This isn't a reality TV show. No, oh, ma'am. Okay, and the king and queen are going to be here. So what are you doing just standing here? Go practice. Go run on. Go. I hope these actors get it right. They don't understand what's on the line here, but I have to prove my aunt's guilt or not. <sighs> Horentia, hi. Oh, what's up, girl? oh my god, okay. So, are you ready? There's gonna be a play tonight. I know, what for? Is there any like reason for that? Yes, yeah, so I'm gonna tell you something, but you can't say anything. Yeah, what's up? So, the last time I saw the ghost, they told me that. Claudia, my aunt, might be responsible for my own mother's death. So this play is basically like a mousetrap to prove whether my aunt is guilty or not. So I need to ask you to keep an eye on Claudia because this play is going to reveal her guilty conscience or not. Yeah, man. That's it's cool. Okay, so, I'll do it for you, homegirl. Okay, thank you. So let's go see this play. Come sit next to me, Miha. No thanks, Dad. I'll sit next to this fine piece of work right here. It's been 30 years since we were married. Let's hope for the 30 more. But I'm sad you've been gloomy lately. It's unlike your usual cheerful self, and I worry about you. I love you, and my fear is just as deep. My love, I'll have to leave you soon. I'm growing weak, and I'll leave you behind in this beautiful world. Perhaps you'll find another husband. Damn everybody else. I can't remarry. It'd be a treason to my heart. Curse me if I remarry. When a woman remarries, it's because she's murdered her first. Some people are married for money, but, so, but never for love. I know this is what you think now, but people change their minds. The promises we make to ourselves in emotional moments lose their power when emotion passes. Joy turns to grief in the blink of an eye, and grief becomes joy just as quickly. It is no surprise even our love changes among with our luck. Love is unreliable. But back to my original point. What we want and what we get are always at odds. Fate decides our futures. You think now you'll never remarry, but that thought will die with me, your first husband. May the earth confuse me food, and the heavens go dark. May I have no rest day and night. May my trust and hope turn to despair. May my every joy be turned to sorrow. May I know no peace in this life or the next one if I remain. You have made this vow with deep sincerity. Now, I would like to sleep and escape this endless day. Sleep tight and may nothing come between us. He will thoughts check. He will potion check. Goddess of witchcraft, help me steal this man's life. Let's go follow them. Okay, it wasn't that bad. But wait. I killed my own sister. My own blood. I'm a sinner against God. Okay, God. I'm gonna try this. Okay. God, please forgive me. I'm truly sorry for killing my sister. God, please wash these sins away from these bloody hands, God. Okay, um, 
what else am I supposed to say? Uh, like, God forgive me for my foul murder? Is that what I'm supposed to say? But I don't have any remorse. I don't regret it. Oh, Dios mío, mándame una señal. Like oh my god! Out. Okay, hold it. Oh my god! Oh my god! god. Oh my god. god. Hey guys! <laughs> Welcome back to our channel! Like that? On the count of three, ready? One. Bye! Bye. Hand, these bloody hands. Fuck! Hold on. <laughs>